Myanmar today is in a constant state of change. This land of boundless potential is pursuing an ambitious development goal. Social and economic prosperity for all citizens. But this vision is constrained by an acute lack of access to electricity. And the rural areas bear the most burden. Right there, a new hope is growing. A hope for a sustainable energy future, in which reliable and achievable energy improves lives and livelihoods. Mini grids can help to meet this challenge. A mini grid rollout could be the key to achieve universal access to electricity in Myanmar. In rural Myanmar, as many as 85% of households remain without electricity. This lack affects virtually all aspects of village life. Healthcare, income, education, food security, and production to drive the local economy. The productive use of electricity in rural communities can boost economic resilience and, in turn, yield improvements in healthcare, education, and many other social sectors. But how can this increased demand for electricity be met? The extension of the national grid will take many years and incur higher costs in remote areas. Solar home systems are unable to generate the capacity necessary to support productive loads. Mini grids are a tailor-made solution to meet the rural demand for electricity from residential, community and productive users alike. These small, isolated power stations and distribution networks, robust enough to support small-scale industries, yet cost-effective enough to supply remote settlements, are well suited to meet both the immediate and long-term needs of Myanmar's growing economy. Mini grids are nothing new in Myanmar. Since the early 1980s, local developers have implemented thousands of micro hydropower and biomass mini grid systems across the country, as well as solar photovoltaic more recently. Despite a lack of commercial business models and state of the art technologies, many of these early community driven mini grids have been operating successfully for decades. These systems set an example of the existing local technical capacities of the private sector and of the community's willingness to pay. The lessons learned from local developers can be leveraged to inform a scaled national mini-grids rollout. This rollout is expected to play a vital role in Myanmar's new national electrification plan. Our vision is up to 2030, especially for the upgrade area. All households have to access to affordable and reliable electricity. Achieving this target will require increased buy-in from the private sector, both national and international, to drive business models and to ensure financial viability of mini-grids. If you bring the professional private sector, that will be a learning for the Myanmar government also, and it is a fast and cost-effective way. It will require an integrated approach to regulation, energy planning and mini-grid policy, which safeguards investors and communities, establishes a sustained project pipeline for mini-grids, and employs innovative policy mechanisms, such as interconnection between mini-grids and the national grid. Technical assistance is needed to fuel sustained growth of the sector. Myanmar presents unparalleled opportunity for those early adopters willing to enter the market. Government, private sector and community, we must work together to achieve the target. Myanmar is a country with the possibilities and then a lot of hard-working people. It's possible. It's possible. With joint commitment, this vision will become a reality. A mini-grid rollout leading to universal access to electricity in Myanmar.